Once the young, rash king of an ancient realm, Viega went mad upon the death of his wife. To bring her back, he'll stop at nothing, even if he destroys everything. Now a powerful wraith, Viego can possess the wills and skills of his adversaries. He's a cruel, skirmishing assassin, and no foe is safe from his merciless blade. The dead will not rest until I am whole once more. Witness the wrath of the ruined king. Welcome to the Viego Champion Spotlight. Viego's passive Sovereign Domain allows him to claim champions who fall to his blade. Upon a killer assist, he can possess them, healing for a percentage of their max health. Possessing a champion allows Viego to become them for 10 seconds, replicating all of their non-ultimate abilities, attacks, and item passes. This is Viego's bread and butter. Use your passive to turn the enemy team's strengths against them. Master yourself, master the enemy. The more you know about your opponents, the better you can best them. Imitation is the most dangerous form of flattery. Fight, puppet! Fight for your king! Blade of the Ruined King is no longer just an item. It's Viego's Q, and it comes with an active and two passives. His first passive makes every basic attack deal a small percentage of his target's current health as bonus damage. Deja vu. For the active, he stabs forward with his sword, dealing damage. Damaging an enemy with any spell triggers the Q's second passive, which makes his next auto attack strike twice. The second strike deals significant bonus damage and heals Viego, so be sure to take a stab at using your blade for sustain. This passive also works while possessing an enemy champion. Viego's W is Spectral Maw. Charge this skill shot to dash forward and hurl a projectile that damages and stuns the first enemy hit. Just be careful, because you're charging in whether you hit or you... missed. His dash range is constant, but the longer you charge, the longer you stun. Keep in mind, Viego can't use this to scale terrain. Looks like he's hit a wall. With his E, Harrowed Path, Viego fires an orb that creates a trail of black mist where he can hide. The mist is my great, unending sadness. Harrowed Path haunts the first wall it hits, covering the area in mist for about 8 seconds. When he's camouflaged by mist, Viego gains movement and attack speed. Gotta go fast. And spooky. Use it to spread your dark domain all across the rift, but watch out! If your enemies spot the cloud, they might just track your location. Viego's ultimate is Heartbreaker. Abandoning any possessed souls, Viego teleports to a nearby location, attacking the enemy champion with the lowest health, applying on hit effects like his Q passive, and slowing them. Nearby enemies will also be knocked back, taking damage as well. You can use your ult as a gap closer to teleport and isolate your target. Call it a hit and run. It's also a ghastly finisher. The lower your target's health, the more Heartbreaker hurts. After learning it, Heartbreaker is always available to be cast while possessing an enemy champion. Use it to exit your host early and shift between bodies, controlling the fate of the fight. Playing the Ruined King requires a bit of patience. This form is nothing to me. Use Harrowed Path away from walls in the early game to keep enemies guessing while you farm the jungle. Once you've hit your stride with your item spikes, it's time to look for those big plays. Your Q's double hit passive has no internal cooldown, so use your abilities mixed with auto attacks to maximize the damage. This combo lets Viego really burst, giving him an edge in a fight. Stay hidden in the mist until you're ready to blitz, borrowing bodies as you take them down one by one. When you're done, just ghost them. The Mist Banker. As an assassin, Viego isn't great when behind. But if he has a head start, he can conquer the rift, quickly turning objectives and team fights to his favor. All this carnage! Do you see? I do it for you! Looking to bring his reign to an end? Be aggressive early game to put the king in his place. Remember, Diego is a conqueror at heart. If you let him collect items, it'll be a missed opportunity to keep him contained. When you're ready to fight, don't just jump in. Unlike other melee assassins, Viego's only escape is his ultimate, which isn't exactly ideal. That crown's looking a little heavy. 
you'll need to build your royal guard with tanky teammates, then seize your opening. Long live the king. Submission or death for all who live. In the end, it matters not. I will see her face again. Wreak havoc upon the rift with the original Heartbreaker. Ready for an era of ruination? Just VA go to the links below.